Joseph Kelly is known as the founding father of Charles City. He was born on June 26, 1806, in Ohio. Kelly was the second person to settle in Floyd County. In the summer of 1851, Kelly moved from Monroe, Wisconsin, to what is now Charles City. When Kelly first arrived to Charles City, the land was actually the Winnebago Indian Village. The village had 150 wigwams, which are Duom dwellings. After arriving at what is now present-day Charles City, Kelly purchased hundreds of acres of land from a U.S. land government office in Dubuque, Iowa, on September 25, 1853. In order to get to the office in Dubuque, he had to ride on a horse to get there. In Kelly's mind, the location of the property was ideal for a town because it was on the Cedar River, which could provide transportation, trade, a source of water, mills, and other smaller needs. Kelly's dream would come true when 25 settler families came to town. The property that was originally bought can be found at what is now Red Cedar Lodge. In 1854, Kelly built a sawmill, and in 1856, he started a grist mill. Although the town is not actually named after Kelly himself, it is named after his son, Charles. As the Civil War concluded, Kelly sold the land to George W. Perrin on December 30, 1865. At the very center of the property still stands a cabin. It is believed to have been built in 1855. Joseph Kelly died on January 13, 1889 in Charles City. He is remembered as a pioneer and a brave man who settled the Charles City that we all know and love today.